Hi everyone, I am Patty Mendoza and today I want to show you some features on Zoom that will help our students communicate with us. So let's get started. So here is my uh, Zoom screen and very, very uh, important for us to model these features for our students so they can navigate. And let, let's just bring this up. It's not just students. It's our, for our own help or any participants, we can never assume that the person that we're on this online platform with know how to navigate these tools. So here are some things. First thing we want to do is get them familiar. So you can see at the bottom, a lot of people begin to talk and we can hear them. So the idea of using a little tool like and using TPR. Oh, and so that tool is down here at the bottom of the screen and they can unmute so that we can hear great great job we have them they're able to be able to speak um during this time there are you know there are many students don't feel comfortable sharing their um you know with themselves with the camera on during the zoom features but um you know we want to train them and show them what the feature is for on maybe you're using it for a roll call so we need this and we can actually use that as well uh, moving on is another piece that's very important is the chat box this is another area that the kids can communicate our participants can communicate and this chat box once I click it and we want to show them click click the chat box and so then the, the tool on the right shows up and they'll be able to type, 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 whatever they um, need to do to communicate with us. Another thing that I think is very important is to show them the participants when, uh, feature on Zoom. And here, not many people know about this, but the participants feature actually has a great way to communicate. So I may have asked them, okay, students, who um, has completed their assignment for today? And so they can hit, it will, yes. And so it would have on the right, you would see a complete list of names and who is actually answering by this little green uh, check. Yes, would actually appear next to their name. Um, some might say, no, uh, I don't have it. So that those are two yes or no features. Um, you might ask, okay, is there anyone that would like me to repeat this? Am I going too fast? I need you to let me know. I need feedback. Maybe someone might say, you know what? Yes, please go slower. And so that little tool comes up and let them know that you are expecting them. So this might be, you know, a great way for them to let you know, slow down, you know, or I'm on it. I'm on the same pace. You can keep on going. Um, there's also more features. Um, Thumbs up uh, if you're ready to go, you know, and we have that as well, TPR, but it's also here in the tool. And so students can use uh, the more feature here and they can do a thumbs up. They can do a thumbs down. Um, bravo, everyone. Round of applause. We can do that always with TPR. We have so many cool uh, applause features that we have one here. They can send someone you know, a class, um, not only to me, they can actually send to the people. They'll definitely show up on this side of the bar. Uh, this little coffee mug feature here is it's time for a break. Let's go ahead and have that five minute break that we were asking for earlier this time. So that's what that little coffee thing means. And then you see there's a time, a little clock. Uh, it could be uh, a way that uh, one to let people know that you're, um, you don't have to ask you, can I go to the restroom, you know, do you, you know, and stop the learning. They can just hit that little button and they, we know as uh, teachers that the students are away from their desk at this time or from their computer without having to interrupt and asking you for that permission. I also like it as that idea of like, hey, we got five minutes before class is up, but really that's what it means. The feature means that the student has stepped away, participants stepped away from their, um, from their computer at this time. So those are some great things to share with your students, and I hope that this um, was helpful. Don't forget to share a great reaction to your students now and then with the reaction buttons, that they're doing a great job, just like everyone, and I can't wait to see how uh, your students use our um, tools here on Zoom. I hope this was helpful. Until the next one, thank you for joining me. Bye.